Hello again everyone, thanks for coming back by the channel. Uh, today we're going to show you our maiden voyage with our new teardrop camper. We've been um, spending the last month or so uh, collecting gear, installing some gear, just kind of making sure that we've got everything that, that we need. Um, plus, um, the weather hasn't really cooperated with us. It's been getting down into the low 30s and below 30, which is a little colder than I want to start our camping adventures in, especially since we don't have all of the uh, necessary cold weather camping gear. We do have a few, but I uh, just want to make sure that our first uh, camping trips are, are, are comfortable for everybody as we start to, to break in the camper and, and figure out what we, um, what we need in terms of uh, gear and organization and things like that. So stick around to find out how we did. And if you like what you see, please consider subscribing to the channel and give us a thumbs up if you did like the video. We sure would appreciate it. So the campground is open year-round. Uh, it has 84 camper sites and 57 of those sites have water, electricity, and sewer. There are 60 uh, sites uh, dedicated for tents only. Each site has a picnic table and fire rings. There's seven bathhouses that are scattered throughout the, um, throughout the campground. And the size of the sites range from 25 feet to 60 feet and dogs are allowed in, in the campground, but obviously they need to be kept on leashes. Hey, not too bad on the first back up. Okay, so we pretty much have the camp set up. We have a few little things we're gonna do, but other than that, we're, we're done. So we're gonna take a few minutes and set a couple of little other things up, a couple of tables and uh, some more chairs, and then we're gonna hit some trails with our bikes, and we'll be back in a bit.
So now here we are back at the campsite. Uh, we had a great spot right on the end. There was nobody to the left or to the right or behind us. We had plenty of room to spread out and uh, relax and get ready for uh, the nighttime activities. Hey, good morning. Uh, made it through the night. Had a great night last night. We sat around the uh, campfire, our little propane campfire, and uh, had some Santa Fe soup and watched a football game and just a, just a great time. Um, got inside the camper. Uh, it was about 10 o'clock at night. It was 55 degrees, something like that. So had no no problem with the weather, no problem with the cold. It was it was just a great night. Really enjoyed it. I'm down here by the lake here in the campground. And we're trying to figure out what we're going to do for the rest of the day. We're trying to figure out if it's going to rain, if it's not going to rain, or when it's going to rain. So um, I think we're going to uh, hang out by the campfire uh, a little bit this morning. Potentially uh, go for a run, or the, the wife and oldest kid will do that. Uh, I'll make some breakfast, then we'll uh, hit the mountain bike trails and see what we can come up with. All right, we're going to start off with a little breakfast this morning. Um, I've got some... I'm going to cook up some hash browns, got some bacon, may put a little cheese on the hash browns, may do a little bacon tortilla uh, with some salsa if we want to. So I'm going to go fire up the camp stove and we'll get started. No taste. What's wrong, man? Awful. That coffee is awful. You'll learn one day. Alright, so the bacon's done. Let's see what we did here. Mm. That's perfect. That's perfect. So we are going to finish up with breakfast. Then we're going to load up, pack up, and hit some more uh, mountain bike trails this morning. But there's just so much to do out here. This state park offers uh, so many things for all different uh, ages of, of people. There's, there's a golf course, there's fishing, there's hiking, there's horseback riding, uh, there's a large playground, there's, there's beaches, um, there's a little marina where you can uh, rent uh, uh, pedal boats and kayaks and canoes and uh, even the stand-up paddleboard. So just, just a lot of things to do for a wide variety of, of ages and family uh, situations. So uh, I would urge everyone to come out and give this state park a try. So all in all, a great maiden voyage, uh, shakedown cruise with our new uh, camper. We're going to uh, head back to our house now. We're going to unload and uh, get the rooftop tent aired out and unpack everything. And uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, please consider giving us a thumbs up and a subscription. We sure would appreciate that.